bet you didn't know this, and we'll kick it off with this. Napoleon, you heard of Napoleon, right? For those that haven't heard of Napoleon, tell us who he, who he was, and you actually said that he accepted Islam? Correct. Talk Napoleon Bonaparte, the, the French conqueror. We all know about him, we all studied about him, but we were never told that uh, toward the end of his life, in the exile, he was, he, he converted to Islam. And actually some of those who were uh, his companions close to him in the exile, they testify that he used to pray and he used to read Quran. Now this is academically sound. Yes, that's I mean, you're his, an academic. That's I mean, in, this his, is, in his own biography. This, this is, is in this his is own. This is not from a Muslim or... Uh, People can go verify some, this. Some Google website. No, no. That is, Napoleon Bonaparte, Bonaparte yeah. accepted yeah. Islam. Correct. This is deep. Correct. In wow. his own biography. In his own biography. Mm -hmm. Now, what are some of the top... I heard, just to mention, please. Napoleon conquered Egypt, mm -hmm. and he claimed to convert at that time. And that was, and he wore the thobe, and yeah. uh, he wore the, the turban, but that all was propaganda just to, to touch on the emotions of the Muslims to, uh -huh. to pass his own agenda. But yeah. later on, toward, in the exile, toward the end of his life, he converted for real. And he was French? Yeah, yeah, French. French now, now this is a, coming from a place, I mean, he's actually like a hero to many friends, right? Oh, yeah, big time.